Here we go then. First final of the year in Croatia. Here we go. Lamb has made a good one, but so has Jason, Jason Doyle. Oh, oh, it's oh, gone too no. wide. He's hit the deck. Oh, oh bitter disappointment for the Australian. He's up on his bike. The race will continue. Smartix out of shape now. Running very wide, but he hangs on to it. Lamb back in second place. Freddie Lingren looking like he's going to be on the rush from this evening. He can just hang on in there. But the world champion out in front. Looking good, set for back-to-back -back wins here in the Donja Kodjevic Stadium. Brilliant stuff from him. Yeah, Lingren's not just uh, settling for the bronze medal tonight. He uh, wants to get past Robert Lambert. He's got the pace to do it, but meanwhile, Sparsling stealing a march up front, just enjoying himself. Brilliant stuff from the world champion. One lap to go. Stunning. Got a feel for Jason Doyle. He was there, all but there, and just got himself in a bit of a trouble and lifted. Round the last turn. First win of the year for Bartosz Smarzik, the world champion. Back-to-back -back victories here in Croatia. The Millennium Stadium, fans on their feet. Delighted to have won here once again. Gets his campaign off to the perfect start here this evening under difficult conditions. He touched the tapes earlier on. He was under pressure, but he's shown great resolve and character, and the class has shone through. Yeah. Superb stuff from Smilesleg. That's why he's a three times world champion. He just worked through difficult conditions, worked through his own mistakes, and uh, well... We Start Marshall just about happy moving away. Green lights on and we're underway. Doyle made a good start, but Smarzik's made a better one. Smarzik round the inside, holds it there. Doyle through into second place. Kim Nielsen holding Jack Holder. No, he can't. Holder coming through into third place. Smarzik out in front. Just got to keep it all together. If he can, he's going to win another Grand Prix. He won the opening round in Croatia. Hasn't managed to win since then, but he's looking good for his second win of the season now. Bata Smarzik. Yeah, Smarzlik faultless towards the end of this meeting. Absolutely fantastic stuff from him. Jason Doyle, after a difficult night last time out in Prague, will be very happy with second place. This race seems to be settling down. And uh, Jack Holder, Mr. Consistent, he's there again. Another podium if he can stay in third place. Indeed he will. They've stretched out. It's not the most Ooh, exciting the final. A little bit of a twitch there from Bartosz Smarzlik on the final lap. <laughs> Through the final corner for the final time here in Tetro. Bartosz Smarzlik stretches the lead once again. Oh, fabulous stuff from him. Terrific uh, return to form for Jason Doyle in second place. And Mr. Consistent certainly is Jack Holder. Back in third place. Delight for Bartosz Smarzlik. Many congratulations to the world champion. Certainly a touch of relief as well, I would suggest. And uh, they uh, are clearly and rightly delighted with that. Didn't win here last year, finished second, but this time around picks up the win. And uh, the first time that he actually wins here in Germany, so clearly, look at that. It means the world to him. Our third Polish winner on the trots here in uh, Germany. So, um, uh, a great uh, legacy for the Poles here, then. But uh, Bartosz Marslik certainly doing the business and uh, finishing it off in style. The inside gate certainly was um, uh, an advantage all through the evening. We've had plenty of race wins from there. Super move by Doyle. Here we go, then. Third time of asking. Ram Farnan and Gorjov. Tapes up for now. Roaring to the first corner, Smarzik and Lingren. Lingren's got there. Leon Madsen, keep your eyes on Madsen. He He's going to roar around the again. outside. Madsen fires himself to the front. Smarzik is relegated to third place. Brilliant move from Leon Madsen. It's worked a treat for him with no rider on gate number three. And Madsen now beginning to power. And here comes Smarzik around the outside. What a move from the championship leader. Winding it on. Leon Madsen now coming under all sorts of oh, pressure. Smarzik, oh, the door slam. And he's looking for a way through. Well, we said, uh, we begged the question, can Smarzik overtake? I've got a feeling it's coming here. He's not going to go. Oh, he has given it up. Gone straight to the outside. That was a very, very quick decision from Smarzik. He's got to be cutting back now. Got to be. One last chance now for Bartosz Smarzik. Right out in the dirt. Leon Madsen has ridden a stormer out in front. One last chance. Up the inside. Smarzik oh, he's done it. He's, he's done it. forced his oh. way to the front. Oh. From Barta back to back Grand Prix wins. The crowd are on their feet. He is an absolute super.
superstar wouldn't be denied tonight. What a fabulous victory for Walter Smarzlik. Desperate for the championship, oh, but nonetheless, nonetheless. What does that what? mean to him? Look at it. Back here at Gorzhov. Leon Madsen actually rode up the safety fence in that last turn. <laughs> Incredible scenes here in Gorzhov in the Edward Yancez Stadium. A fabulous conclusion to a Grand Prix here. Round number five, a sparkling final. We had to wait, we had to do it three times. But Bartosz Smarzlik just wouldn't be denied. Can you show me that last lap again and again and again? I could watch that a hundred times. Now oh, the yeah, they're under massive pressure. Smarzlik <laughs> in gate two, Freddy Linger in gate two, three, gate four for Martin Vasilik. Here we go, third time of asking. Oh, Linger out of the start. What a start that is. No pink on his uh, hat. He doesn't care. Into second place comes Bartosz Smarzlik coming on strong. Down the. Oh. <laughs> Tight going into turn number three. Freddie Lingwin holding the inside line. Smarzik round the outside. Vasilik back in third place. Smarzik's got more speed. I will be surprised if he doesn't go straight past Freddie Lingwin. Look at that. How much speed has he got? He has found the right setup. Lingwin now back up the inside. Can he get down there? No. Smarzik, perfect. Superb stuff, fabulous start initially from Freddie Lingren out of shape now. The track has deteriorated quite significantly. The Bartosz Marslik out in front. Dramatic scenes here in the final. One more lap to go. He's going to win his fourth Grand Prix of the championship chase. Totally dominant. Failed to uh, make the final in Melilla just a month ago. Won the Speedway World Cup, of course, two weeks ago in Wroclaw. And Bartosz Marslik on top of the box again. Wins in style. He hasn't had it all his own way here this afternoon. Had an exclusion early on. But Smarzlik will not be denied. I tell you, look what it means to him. He's earned that one, hasn't he? He oh. earns every single one of them. But that was a tough night for him. Yeah, it was a tough night. Freddie Ling were making him work over time there with a stunning start initially. Many congratulations to the championship leader, the world champion. Moves on to 122 points now. Stretches his lead in the World Championship. The speed he went past Freddie Lindgren after Freddie had made such a superb start, it has to be said, yeah. was unbelievable. Yeah, it was indeed. Stunning performance once again from Bartosz Smarzlik. Desperately disappointing for Ty Wooford and picks up 14 World Championship points, but he was looking set for a win. His wait for a Grand Prix win will continue. Can he do it? In the Principality Stadium in Cardiff in three weeks' time, he'll be very much hoping so. But for Bartosz Smarzlik right now, overjoyed with another win, never ceases to have the hunger to win. Overjoyed with his performance in the Speedway World Cup, delighted with the team's efforts there. But back to individual World Championship chase, and Bartosz Smarzlik now has one hand on the trophy. You have to say that. Oh, uh, yeah, well, I'm pretty certain he's got two hands on the trophy, you've got to be honest. But uh, extends the lead, but of course not by too many with three lingering. Which way is it going to go now? The green light's on. Takes her up, Smarzlik's made it. What a start from Smarzlik, doesn't miss it. Freddie Lingren coming through in second place, slamming the door shut on Leon Madsen, but Smarzlik's away. Freddie's got lots of work to do from there. Leon Madsen now coming up the inside, pushing hard in third place. But Smarzlik nailed the start there on the inside gate. Uh, Bartosz Smarzlik doing everything right from the inside gate. It's a fitting way for him to secure his fourth World Championship if he can stay there. Oh, look at him wheeling out front. He has got that thing hooking up and going quick. Lingering in second place under pressure from Madsen, but that will be irrelevant. Smarzlik out front, looking good. Smarzlik now, just a lap away for his fourth World Championship. Leon Madsen now coming through, pushing hard in third place, trying to get the better of Responds, comes through the second place. But out of the last corner, Bartosz Smarzik is a four-time world champion. What a night for him. After all the drama two weeks ago in Bayern. Wow, what a way to respond. Back-to-back Eschen. Back, tell you what, he did it in style, he didn't he? Did he? Did that would have been a terrible two weeks leading up to this meeting. He's and look through. how he's responded. Absolutely right, Chris. He's been through agony. He was crying, he was desperate after Boyens. Been DQ'd there. 
but he's come back here two weeks later and he's just proven to everybody, I am the man. Fourth World Championship, back-to-back -back championships. What a night for Smarslik. You've got to give a lot of credit to Freddie as well. Oh, he took it to him, didn't he? He's taken it to him. He's ridden strongly throughout the year. But in the end, that start in the final just shows you why he's a four-time world champion. Brilliant scenes, brilliant scenes. Yeah, fully deserved. The way he's responded to the disappointment in Voyens has been outstanding. Acted professionally, apologised to his fans, came here, got on with the job. Absolutely right. And Bartosz Smarslik now, tremendous sportsmanship there. When you get the drama like that, when it goes down to the final race in the final round, doesn't get better than that. Sporting